This video will demonstrate how to use the Twitter interface in Baseball Scorebook. First, select Options and then the Twitter tab. Now click on the Login Twitter button. You'll be directed to Twitter's website. From here, you authorize Baseball Scorebook to use your Twitter account. Log into your account and select the Authorize App button. Your profile picture will be downloaded into the app. Select OK. Now you're ready to start tweeting your games. Let's create a new game. Tap the Twitter button to activate tweets for this game. Now, whenever you score an at-bat and select the Next button, a tweet will be sent out to your account. This will include the current score and a screen capture of the current screen. Switching over to a browser and accessing your Twitter account, you can see where the tweet was sent. Now let's switch back to the app and score another at bat. This time, let's put the player on first base. Now, a tweet hasn't been sent yet until you select the next button. Here you can see how, let me refresh the Twitter screen. You can see how the last at bat was posted. Put Mike Pizza on first base. Now let's go back to the app. Now let's say Mike Pizza stole second base. Since this event isn't automatically tweeted, let's select the Twitter button and select Tweet Current Screen Now. This will send out a tweet of the current screen. Switching back to the Twitter page and refreshing, you'll see where that was tweeted. So to summarize, tweets are automatically sent out every time you select the next button. However, if events occur that you would like to send out a tweet about, then you can select the Twitter button and tweet current screen now. If you'd like to see the Twitter page used in this example, just go to at Jack Foolery Test. And for more information on Baseball Scorebook, visit us at jackfoolery.com. Thank you.